this is the 2008 AP Multiple Choice Form A, problem number one. Okay, so once we multiply out the binomials and then combine like terms, we have negative 2x squared over x squared as the leading coefficients. And then when x is approaching infinity for the limit, all we need to do is negative 2 divided by 1, which gives us negative 2 as our limit for number 1. Okay, so number 2 asks for the integral of 1 over x squared. So what we do is rewrite it as x to the negative second power. Then taking the antiderivative of that, we raise the exponent 1 and divide by the same exponent. So we get x to the negative 1 over negative 1 plus c. And then that gives us d for our final answer. Negative x to the negative 1 plus c. Okay, so number 3 asks us for the derivative of x minus 1 times x squared plus 2 cubed. To solve this one, we're going to use the product rule. Okay, so then following the product rule, we have f prime g plus g prime f. Next, we factor out of x squared plus 2 squared, so we get x squared plus 2 plus 6x times x minus 1, and then when we multiply that out, we get x squared plus 2 squared times 6x times x minus 1 plus x squared plus 2, which gives us 7x squared minus 6x plus 2 for f prime of x, which means the answer is d. Okay, so number 4 wants the antiderivative of sine of 2x plus cosine 2x. So you uh, take the antiderivative of each term separately. Antiderivative of sine 2x is negative cosine 2x over 2. Antiderivative of cosine 2x is sine 2x over 2 plus c. Then we factor out a 1 half, so we get negative 1 half cosine of 2x plus 1 half sine of 2x plus c. And this is our antiderivative, which gives us the answer of 